guys welcome to the vlog today is valentine's day and angie just came home from school and well, she picked up <laughs> yeah i had to pick i had to pick her up because she wasn't feeling good today but she is looking through all of her valentines comment below do you get your kids valentine's gifts even if it's just a card or a little you know box of those candies where are they you got one did you show them wait i got you no not yet like something like this or just something small just to say hey i love you and it's valentine's day and also she actually got me a little valentine's gift which i was really surprised um i put it away already but i will i'll take a picture of it and show it i should have took a picture of it how was your i didn't what was your what was your reaction when she saw it i was like does she not know that that bag was for her i was like and she put mine next i was thinking like then i saw a mom and I, I was definitely not expecting that in the morning. I was thinking that the, the bag that I gave you would be gone. <laughs> so I wasn't expecting right. something for me. Happy Valentine's Day. I got one. I gotta go. Okay. Right and Kilo got me um, some stuff and he gave me $50. So that was cute. Too bad I can't smell the rose. Yeah, she's sick. Poor Did thing. you cut it in the corner? In the no, I didn't do anything to it yet. So anyway, this... Um, Although it's Valentine's Day, uh, you know, um, well, that's the reason why I'm dressed in red and kind of dressed up because I'm really not going anywhere, yeah. but it's Valentine's Day. So sometimes even if you have nowhere to go, it still feels nice to just get dressed up. So I did my hair, I switched my glasses, I put some earrings on and I'm about to give you guys a Walmart haul <laughs> because we had an order this morning. So, if you want to see what I got in this Walmart haul, um, stay tuned. Keep watching. All right, guys. So, okay. So, this is what my kitchen currently looks like right now. All these bags. Just, uh, just so waiting for me to show you what I got. So, we are going to get right into it. All right, I know that eggs have been really, really expensive, but I feel like I haven't been going broke for no eggs because I've always bought this big giant box and this box is $17, but you get 60 eggs. And I know people have been paying $8 for a dozen of eggs. So why are you doing that, guys? Why aren't you getting them from Walmart? I mean, I know it's a lot of eggs, but I mean, if you have a big family, get the big one. It's 16 bucks, like 12, 24. You only get 24 for the same amount that you would just buy the box. And so I bought this. I used to only use medium grain Goya rice, okay? And then I started buying the long grain by uh walmart brand um and i i mastered it because i used to not know how to make um long grain rice but i mastered it and i can make it really good but i decided to buy a medium grain again and after buying a medium grain i realized i do not like the medium grain anymore so i went and i per I, I got rid of it he fell in love with that one. And and this one's cheaper and I just I just like it better. So now I'm into the long grain rice. So um I got this big thing thing of thing of rice here. And I am going to put I think I'm going to put the stuff away as I am telling you because I mean kill two birds with one stone, right? <laughs> Boom. Oh forgot that I wanted to wash my refrigerator out uh, anyway hold on I gotta I gotta clean up my fridge come on it's not it's really not that bad guys but it used to be yeah let's clean it real quick really fast just a quick quick wipe down Oops, 
too much. I'm going to a little bit. Get rid of all the leftovers. So, I do still have eggs. They're almost out, so we'll take those out. I usually, I'll take those out and put them in a bowl. And so, that's it. It works! Yay! See? It's kind of hard to fill it up because I got a little too little. Yeah, but you did it. It holds a lot of motion in there. Good. Are you putting it in the bowl again? I could have used a smaller bowl actually. Oh, I'm hungry. I could have used a smaller bowl, but so we're gonna go like that and put it back in. Oh, I made some baked potatoes. They're gone in the bag. All right. We're not really gonna deal with the door right now, so don't even worry about the door, okay? We're just... Wow, I really like this. Good. I, I thought so. Angie has been wanting these little containers. Don't show them yet. Angie has been wanting these, new these little containers. She's all about aesthetic, okay? So, she saw these containers. She was gonna buy them with her Amazon gift card that she got for her birthday on Amazon, but they were like, seven dollars each right and i'm like that and she kept asking me ma should i buy it should i buy it? is it worth it i'm like it's your money you really want it then go ahead well it was a little container where you push down and your face lotion or whatever lotion you have comes out right little cosmetic container well when i was at the dollar store and usually we use these for like um nail polish remover. nail polish remover or something but as I was in the dollar store getting some of her stuff, I came across these. And I'm like, this is basically what she was looking for, okay? It looks a little bit more fancier because it's like, you know, the one on Amazon because it's, it's like... It's bigger it, and... It's like, not bigger. It's about the same size. But it, um, it is like, uh, you know, silver and it's not pink or whatever. But nonetheless, she took her face stuff. She put it in here. Like I told. And it works. Can you see it? Mm-hmm. And you get lotion in here, like that. And then you get your lotion. Mm -hmm. So it works, guys. So if you were looking to got to get one of those things, like to put on your your dresser or whatever, it freaking works. And they're at the dollar tree. And if you wanted to like go traveling or something. You can put your lotion in here. Anyway, back to the original uh, progression of this of this video. Yeah. Just a little DIY hack, just saying. We must go through this stuff. Okay, oopsie. It's been out for an hour. And you got ice cream. It's okay. I, I like it all today. I forgot, I forgot about oh, that. these fun ones. Look how cute they okay, are. Okay, so this is what my freezer looks like right now. I still have some one meat. of our freezers. One of our freezers. <laughs> um, I still have some meat. I have some chicken. I have some ground um, shredded steak. Uh, but I bought some free, some more freezer stuff. So. What are you doing? Pot pie is still in there. Your All right. So. Oh. On mom's lazy days, I bought a bunch of these voila meals. Okay? And 
I got three cheese chicken and another three cheese chicken because depending on if we have company or not, um, you know, I can make that. And these I put in the big freezer. I think I'm gonna put them in here. Just so I remember. Oh. Bunch of vegetables, cauliflower, peas. Put these in the big freezer. Cauliflower, peas, more peas, some broccoli. Okay. Uh, chicken carbonara. Chicken con carne. Chicken con carne. Chicken con carne. And more sweet peas. Boom. One bag down. Oh, you bought meatballs? Yep, I got meatballs. Maybe I'll make I have to cook those meatballs, by the way. So. I got obsessed with this chicken, Mom. Really? Yeah, I'm gonna cook some meatballs. Oh. So, I don't know if you guys know, we've been trying to get more vegetables in our life. So, we got another yeah. big broccoli. I love vegetables. We are. We are stacked with greens, guys. I got these, more green beans. I got okra, no, Brussels sprouts. I got some Brussels sprouts. That's new, I haven't bought those, but they were cheap. We got some corn. How you sing that song, Angie? Corn. No. Whatever, we got some corn. She's tacky. Um, more green beans. Angie loves green beans. I do love green beans. She does love green beans. And carrots. But she only likes the carrots with, you know, some butter and some um, brown, sugar. brown sugar in it. So we got some noodles. Because I am trying to stack up my pantry, even though I don't really have much room in my pantry. But got some bow ties for when I make um, sausage, uh, spinach, cheesy bow ties. Two things. We got some half length spaghetti so I don't have to like break it and whatever. I really didn't think it was going to be this small but it is whatever. I got three boxes of those. So if you guys don't know, I got more elbows. They um cut the amount for food stamps so everybody who was getting those extra you're not getting those extra as of well in Connecticut anyway you're not getting the extra um deposit which mine was like $95 but hey who's complaining right well we're not getting it anymore as of March so yeah. if you're smart you're stacking up right now so that's what I'm doing so I got more macaroni and cheese 50 cents a box I used to be able to get them for like 40 something a box, but now they're, they were 50 cents a box. The shell ones? Yeah. Ooh, ooh, I like those. More shell ones, me too. Um, I got more elbows. Kilo, we really, we really need. Um, these are all chicken. That's all chicken? And meat. Like okay, meat. But I gotta show them. So. I got a, a real Velveeta. Usually I get the great value one but I got the real one because we were eating a lot of um, broccoli and cheese I got Ooh. I got four of these they were like a dollar 98 cheaper than whatever Kilo's not gonna be happy but he'll be happy when you know he, he'll never know just add a little bit of sugar it tastes like fucking ragu Prego. A little bit of little bit of sugar and um, a basil or something, you know, the spaghetti seasoning. Good to go, right, babe? Yeah. Okay. We got some garlic bread. We got this is for lunch. Some boneless it? chicken bites. Is it the is it the spicy ones? Yeah. Barbecue ones. The ones that you liked last time. She's happy. Another one. I think what I'm gonna take this out. I don't like it. Uh, take it out the box. I guess it. 
I got family size chicken parmigiana. Parmigiana. Parmesan. <laughs> chicken parm and penny. We got um Oh, did we get regular rolls. bread? Yeah. Okay. We got some rolls. I usually I keep one out, I, I freeze one. I always freeze my bread if I have an extra one or I put it in the fridge. I'm gonna need in the fridge. Uh, so Kilo likes to eat these for lunch. Mild Italian sausage. So I got some of those. Like a oh. white chicken kind of carne. I got my salad. Now these are expensive. Okay, this was five dollars. Okay, but I don't eat a lot, guys. So for lunch. I will eat, say, I don't know, ask daddy. I will eat a salad for lunch. If I don't have to think about making it, I'll eat it. Not mine. Mm. And I do occasionally be on like a real heavy salad kick. So I got a Cobb salad, a little one, a big one for the family. Uh, they substituted this one and it's apple and walnut ch uh, salad with chicken. I can't eat it because there's walnut in it. So that, this is yours. Sounds good. Or Angie's. It doesn't matter. Uh, another Cobb salad. And another Cobb salad. Girl, you Cobb salad up. So, sometimes, guys, sometimes I'll even... I like to buy them like this because I'm finding that if I buy them in the bag, um, they, go they go bad fast. And I know I can get them like the uh, romaine lettuce stalks. But then I have to make the whole salad. I don't know. I, I just find that I don't waste as much money getting it like this. And occasionally, this will give everybody a handful of salad at dinner. So if I don't eat it for myself, I, I use it for dinner. So. Um, I got creamer. I got a big thing of creamer. And I got another thing of the donut shop. I've been buying these because Kilo is really not drinking coffee anymore and I'm the only one so um, the coffee lasts a really long time and yeah I really didn't need to get that and then I got another cream like this that's messed up bro so if we drink coffee together I get the average coffee but if you drink coffee by yourself you get the top shelf coffee that ain't top shelf <laughs> that's great value it's just in the little pot i'm just kidding chicken con carne oh some sour cream daddy like a favorite word yeah chicken con carne we got some tomatoes i get these tomatoes because we don't eat a lot of tomatoes um and i can use these for they're cheaper they're 44 cents instead of buying like a big one it looks better on your sandwich but Tomato, tomato, right? It doesn't really matter. It's a tomato on your sandwich, so. Um, got some Italian bread. Now, I get these Italian bread because when you order online from Walmart, it is very rare that you will find white, great value bread. So, you're they're going to make you buy like Sara Lee or something, and those are like three something. So. When I shop on Walmart, I always get this and then I slice it and it's a loaf of bread for a dollar forty seven. Just pinch and pennies, pinch and pennies. Then I got three packs of these because it was cheaper to get three packs and not pay for the big one. So I got three packs of plates. I got some salsa con carne. No, it's not. It's not. It's not with me. It's just regular salsa. But Kilo's on a um, chicken con carne kick. So I said That's con new. carne. All right. So I guess I did get a Wonder Bread. I got one. I got. I got a Wonder Bread. Bro, that should be the only bread we used to buy when I was a kid. Yeah, well, that junk is fucking. That was expensive. And then I did. They did actually give me a slice. Usually when I order from Walmart, they always end up giving me a full one and it's not sliced, so I'm glad they listened this time. Thanks, Walmart. <laughs> These are all, look at all the bags. These are all the bags on the floor. Are we, are we I'm folding them, I'm folding them, yeah, for the calendar. Okay, well, those ones are ripped. 
Okay, so we are recycling them. We usually do, but I wasn't sure if he wanted more. And I guess we should save it for like fire. When we do a fire, which we really don't, but I do want to start doing that. Um, okay, so I got this for me also for lunch with some crackers and cheese. Woo! I did get a head of lettuce. I find that this lettuce stays better, even though it's not as nutritionist. Nutritionist? Is that how you say it? There's not as much nutrition in this, there we go, than the romaine lettuce, but whatever. I got the cheese. I got in a room full of crackers. That's what meant the man said. In a room full of crackers, don't forget to cut the cheese. Shout out to Method Man. Um, I got some sweet apple with Vermont maple syrup, um, chicken sausage. I like the other ones, so I figured I'd like these ones. We got a kielbasa for an easy dinner. We got more cheese because I did make this um I did make this chicken pot pie recipe, which I'm gonna try again. Differently made? though. Huh? Is that the one you mommy? No. Chicken pot pie? Yeah. Chicken con carne? Did you wanna say that, Kilo? I said it in my head. <laughs> Anytime I say chicken, he's gonna wanna say chicken con carne. I don't care. So this is a pretty big order, guys. It was three hundred dollars for this. Ah. I got her her dang old Takis. Maybe it'll clear up your sinuses here. Oh my God. We have four more boxes of Penny. I and I got this kind because they usually, when I go to Walmart, they usually never have this. They usually never have the Penny, the Penny um. Okay. We're good, we, we some carb lovers anyway. I think we have enough Good. Here's your honey mustard. Don't forget to put it in the fridge. Yay! And we got some ham. Open it, open it, and put it in the fridge. Oh yeah, I'm gonna eat it. And this is all the meat that I got. We got. I did not know that this was seventeen dollars, but I usually make this. This is the uh, chuck pot roast. Uh, do we need these? Guys? I usually make this and then freeze the rest of the meat so I can actually make two meals out of this. So, I do that, and I do it like shredded. So. All right, so hold on baby, don't talk. Let me just get all this back up here. Got some shredded steak. I have one in the refrigerator to make um, steak and cheese subs, which I think I'm gonna have to because I took so long, I took so long to do Clean it. I'm I, took, it. I took so long to do the food that it's kind of defrosted. But if you get this and it's <laughs> still frozen, you can or or freeze by. I could freeze it. Maybe I'll freeze it. Babe, you want steak and cheese tonight? No, we yeah, had we just had steak. No, here. Oh yeah, we did have steak yesterday, yeah. though. Mom, I'm gonna throw out this old one. There's barely anything left. Okay. Yeah. Did you show them this? Yeah. I got these. Oh, you read the card, right? Because the card said exactly what we were thinking about. You, Andrew. You read the oh, card, yeah, right? Because they see the $10 at the card now. You read the card, no, right? No, I read it, yeah. Okay, good. <laughs> okay, good. I like $10. And I go to that. I got some ground beef. More ground beef. So much pasta. I know. I tried to stack up because I was thinking, like, you know, if all else fails, At least I know if all that. else fails, we have pasta and rice, you know? Yes. Oh, well, I see we got ham. We ain't going to die. Ham on, ham on and cheese. And then I got some stew meat to make with some rice and some sauce. So, did I miss anything? I got everything. And I got some water. I got some water. 
So now it's time. And we got milk and juice. Oh, and I got milk juice. and orange juice because shout out to everybody telling me, Melly, make sure when you are taking your iron to take it with vitamin C, right. orange juice, whatever, whatever. I love you guys. You're always looking out for me. Mwah. So I listened and I bought the orange juice, even though I can't drink a lot of orange juice because it will upset my stomach, but I will definitely take it with the orange juice. Yeah. Alright, so I guess I'll just let you come along and watch me put it away. I belong, I belong to you. I belong, I belong to you. Job is done. The freezers are filled. The fridge. The other freezer. So usually I just put all of the frozen vegetables in here and like bagged stuff like the like the um the voila dinners i usually put in here um but i'm gonna keep them over there so that i remember hey melissa um if you're having a lazy day just cook this you know so that's about it and got my cabinets done i don't know if you saw how when i was doing it and then here's the pantry um so we got that. So clean. If you didn't see the video of Kilo organizing the pantry, you should totally go to his channel, Kilo Forgotten. Kilo has been on it and popping on his channel. He's having a giveaway every month. Really? So if you don't know, go to the link in the description. It's my husband, Kilo. Um, Kilo Forgotten. Click on the link, go subscribe to the channel, be a part of the giveaway, and uh, you'll also see him organizing this. So, all right, guys, 
I hope I motivated you putting your groceries away. I hope I gave you a video that you that you wanted if you clicked on this video to see a Walmart haul. I hope I gave it to you. Until the next video, I love you mucho. And we, we, you feel a little warm now. We'll catch you on the flip side. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, guys. Tips and lipsticks and acrylics Just talk about it all, big and small I care, quick hair tutorial With family vlogs to share Just me being me, on the limb of my family tree